Hi, hello everyone. Today we are going to have a look on Inflow Online Dashboard Overview. Let's begin. This is the Inflow Online Dashboard and this is a, a landing page of very first installation. So this Towards your left hand side you have uh, widgets, you can add widgets to have uh, more visibility. So there are different presets which you can incorporate with your usage. And towards right hand side you have your admin identity. So in that you can add more credentials if you would like. For example, pin number. So the moment you click pin number automatically generated and it will be pushed to your email. But still being admin, you would be able to check what is your pin number. Similar way, you can add your username or login name. So whatever the information is missed, still you could able to do manually. Similar way, some of the unwanted informations you can remove by toggling the three dots. So this is a notification area. It will tell you what is next to be done, step-by-step -step process. So once you completed all the notification, which means you are good enough in the Iniflow online installation and configuration process. So follow one by one step. So it's basically shortcut for you to complete the task. So in the dashboard, you have a start printing, user, print and scan, reports, extension, settings, task, locations and legal notice. These are the key uh, buttons, uh, subjects and which will have more options in it. So this is my profile. Uh, you could make an advance so that I'll have more privileges so I can act as an administrator. And so still you can apply multifunction, multi-factor authentication and towards next button is my tenant. So this is my tenant actually and uh, I'm associated with uh, what tenant ID. It is very much important and in tenant what are the subscriptions I do have. That's something really important. So I have, uh, I'm in a trial mode. I have not activated any setting, any printers as of now. And the next one is clip uh, help help will talk about the particular menu what you have and how you can move on now I have clicked the help when I am in dashboard so it is showing uh, the dashboard related topics so hope you like this video thanks for watching